The fifth and last consideration of sustainable design is visually pleasing, what you would like to see in your landscape. Just a refresher, the five considerations of sustainable design are functional, maintainable, environmentally sound, cost-effective, and visually pleasing, and they are in that order of consideration. Having a visually pleasing landscape is actually the last of the five considerations of sustainable landscape design. It can be very subjective from an artistic standpoint and also personally important to whomever the landscape is for. This is a great house uh, up in the Alexandria area and you can see that it has great views from its uh, deck and of its gardens and it has a very inviting entry garden. So these are very nice visually appealing spaces and also very functional. There's a lot of room for dining and getting together. Uh, there's room for playing in the turf area. The gardens are easily maintained and so is the entry area. Uh, it's easy to throw the snow on the herbaceous plants that die back every year over on the sides of the of the sidewalk here going into the front door and it's a nice uh, kind of curving entry that uh, that's very intriguing and inviting. This is another visually pleasing landscape. This is at the Minnesota Landscape Arboretum in the Perennial Garden and lots of color, lots of beautiful uh, textures, great layering of plants and we have the water feature as well which is always a real draw. This is a more naturalized area. This is at Silverwood Park in St. Anthony. And it is a naturalized type of planting with big masses of pollinator-friendly plants and grasses. And then it also has a large turf area which is used for gathering, uh, for gatherings for, uh, and for uh, events. If a landscape is functional, if it can be maintained at the level that the client would like it to be maintained at, if it's environmentally sound, meaning that it has a positive impact on the surrounding environment, and if it's cost effective and can be managed uh, from a cost standpoint, it will be visually pleasing. Then it, the rest of it is icing on the cake. Now go to the last presentation. This is a case study that demonstrates how to apply the five considerations to a home landscape design project. 